This is Charlie from Charlie's Awesome World of Adventures and today I'm going to finally give my review on senior year. I've watched this review man and I think it's the only time I get my review on it. It, it is about Stephanie, a senior student who has, has been in the coat almost for 20 years. It, when she's asked what she's going to do the rest of her life, I she thought, oh she fit. She finish what she started and go and go back back to school to finish off her senior year. Yeah, yeah, that's basically all I can get into with the story. And I've been wondering how has this taken me so long to get a real one? Well, I'm not. I've actually not been sure how to film this movie. It's definitely not the best movie ever, but it's definitely not the worst movie either. Just now, I think that this is a decent film. Not the best, but not the worst either. So, apologies if this review is pretty short though. Anyway, with the characters, characters, oh, she's not. To that end, they're an interesting cast. Uh, but uh, as you are technically kind of found in these types of high school films, you've got Stephanie, the girl who's been. In the cult, oh my that wants to finish her last year, her senior year. Yeah, however, all the rules are different now because of her, her new principal, Martha, for, for, who was Stephanie's old friend, and and and, and Seth, one of, one of Stephanie's friends, and who's, who's had a crush on her. She not, as, as she not, uh, and Tiffany is the, is the villain who is, who, who, who want, wants to live the perfect life and puts a lot of pressure, shot on her daughter Bree. E, the latter is actually a pretty interesting character. Well, she may seem like the typical high school bully in these types of films, but she act like the typical mean girl. But she actually offers a lot of, of, of peer pressure yeah, because of her mum. Oh, making her more of the wonderful, interesting characters. As, as, as for the actors, I, I will admit Rebel Wilson does do a good job with Stephanie. Really have much to say about the other actors in this movie. They're not really bad, and they do offer a decent performance, but but they're definitely not the most memorable performances. So while the characters are not the strongest aspects, they at least do try their best. One thing that is actually a pretty strong aspect is the story. Yes, this is definitely not the most most original story. Wait, where is it? But it's actually quite unique. Where uh, Stephanie wants to finish her, her senior year after being in the coma for 20 years. Yes, granted, it is a typical story that's found in these high school films, so it can feel a little predictable at times. However, the execution does kind of help with it. It, it manages to show this concept up really, as the, uh, with this girl who, who really wants to finish, finish the, the, the school year that she started. To, and is willing to do all she can and to accomplish it. It, it grant, granted, it was definitely not exciting an exciting story, it does try its best in the material. Oh, like the heart of Stephanie real realising what's most, most important. On all the humour, humor, which does also show all the stuff that Stephanie has missed while she's been in a coma. Oh my. And then there are 
more than visual effects. And I can have to say that this is a, an undecent looking film. Granted, it's not the most or jaw breaking or exciting looking movie you will ever see in your life, but I will admit that the visuals are pretty decent. Since the backgrounds do do show this school as a strong place, and the costumes really work well, especially with the with Stephanie's cheerleading the year. So, oh yeah, even though it's not the the most uh, exciting visuals, as it doesn't really do anything new, at least they are interesting nonetheless. So overall, while it's not the best single find on Netflix, it is still a solid feature. Singing Gear is an okay a movie that does try its, uh, its best for the materials it's got. Oh, the characters are definitely not the strongest aspect, <laughs> but it does make up for it with some decent acting, some okay visuals, and a solid, there's enough story oh, that does actually work well. While I wouldn't say a, that this is a high recommendation, if you are a fan of these types of high school films, you know I recommend it. And to watch it at least once to see how you feel on it. it, it I may not remember everything about Stephanie singing here, but this is her last year. It was a decent one, nonetheless. And that's why I'm going to give this one on a 6.5 out of 10. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to comment, like, and subscribe, and I will see you next time.